In the vast tapestry of human history, the original civilizations of the American continent stand as testaments to the ingenuity and achievements of ancient cultures. Yet one cannot help but wonder why these remarkable societies did not embrace a seemingly elementary invention that revolutionized transportation elsewhere, the wheel. To unravel this enigma, we must journey back in time to the rich tapestry of Mesoamerican and Andean civilizations and explore the factors that shaped their technological landscape. Firstly, it is important to note that the absence of wheel technology in these ancient cultures was not due to a lack of knowledge or understanding of the concept. They were well aware of the wheel's existence, as evidenced by children's toys and artistic depictions. So why didn't they harness its potential? Geographical factors played a significant role in this disparity. The American terrain was diverse, featuring rugged mountains, dense jungles, and vast stretches of swamps. Navigating such challenging landscapes demanded adaptability, and it led to the development of alternative means of transportation. People relied on human labor, employing methods like carrying loads on their backs, using sledges, or utilizing the buoyancy of boats to traverse rivers and lakes. Furthermore, the absence of large domesticated animals capable of pulling wheeled vehicles was another crucial factor. Unlike Eurasia, where horses, oxen, and other draft animals were present, the Americas lacked these beasts of burden. This absence meant that the introduction of wheeled transportation would have required significantly more human effort, limiting its efficiency and practicality. The existing transportation systems in Mesoamerica and the Andean region were astoundingly sophisticated and efficient, despite the lack of wheels. Ancient civilizations developed an extensive network of roads, footpaths, and causeways, enabling the movement of people, goods, and ideas across vast distances. Trade flourished, cultural exchange thrived, and societal structures evolved harmoniously within the framework of these alternative methods. Moreover, focusing on non-wheeled technology fostered the development of other groundbreaking innovations. For instance, the Andean cultures constructed an ingenious system of roads and suspension bridges in the mountainous terrain known as the Kapak Nan. This marvel of engineering facilitated communication and trade, surpassing the need for wheeled vehicles. While the absence of wheels did not impede the growth of these civilizations, it undoubtedly influenced their societal structures and cultural practices. The lack of wheeled transportation necessitated a decentralized model of governance, with city-states and regional centers, rather than large empires. This decentralization allowed for a diverse array of cultural expressions, architectural styles, and political systems to flourish independently. The absence of wheels also influenced agricultural practices. Without animal-drawn plows, the American civilizations developed innovative techniques such as terraced farming and chinampas, floating gardens. These agricultural methods maximized the use of available resources and fostered sustainable farming practices, demonstrating the adaptability and resilience of these ancient societies. In the absence of wheels, labor-intensive practices thrived, leading to the establishment of strong social structures and communal values. Cooperation and collective effort became deeply ingrained in the fabric of society, shaping the cultural identity of the American civilizations. The absence of wheeled technology promoted a sense of interdependence and collaboration, enriching the social tapestry of these remarkable cultures. However, it is crucial to acknowledge that the absence of wheeled transportation did impose limitations on trade networks and the exchange of goods over long distances. Bulkier items had to be transported by utilizing human labor, which restricted the scale and efficiency of commerce. Nonetheless, societies found innovative solutions to overcome these challenges, such as the use of llama caravans in the Andean region and extensive river networks in Mesoamerica. In summary, the original civilizations of the American continent did not develop wheel technology due to a confluence of geographical factors, the absence of suitable draft animals, and the efficacy of alternative transportation methods. This absence, 
while limiting long-distance trade and large-scale empires, nurtured diverse cultural expressions, promoted social cohesion, and spurred the development of alternative innovations. The story of these ancient civilizations teaches us that progress is not solely defined by a linear path, but is shaped by the unique challenges and circumstances encountered by each society.